Yo, this is Matt V2099, and uh, I've got a story for you, and an uh, interesting test here. So number one, my Glock finally broke, or a small part inside the Glock finally broke. After a year and a half of doing these stupid videos, the recoil spring broke in three spots. So fortunately I had a new one on standby for the last year, and so it was an easy fix, but uh, you can see that's like truly messed up. And so there's, four, there's two brakes here, you can see them, and then another one right there. There we go, right there. Despite that, I bet it'll still work. It probably broke during my last test, because before, it wasn't bad, it wasn't broken before, but during the turtle wax, it probably broke while I was shooting it. I mean, I don't... I can't imagine it broke while I was just sitting there doing nothing afterwards. But, as we can see during that video, the Glock worked just fine. So, anyways. And after doing these stupid videos for a year and a half, uh, I'm going to be winding down a little bit. So here's your opportunity. Any of you assholes wants to uh, start making Glock videos and, and uh, take over that niche from me, please do so. I'm not going to be... Uh, uploading them as much as I used to. So we, uh, we broke the Glock. So, <clears throat> okay, so since I finally broke this fucking Glock, I have a really cool test to do. I'm gonna do some factory lube. Okay, so this is the lube that the, the Glock comes with. It comes with this weird, coppery lubricant. Right? So we're gonna just slather that in there and make it like brand new. You know, it's factory lube. But anyways, let's do this. Okay, so take some of this here factory lube. Just kind of put it all up in there like that. Yeah, yeah. Let's get rid of this fucking thing. That's a brand new recoil spring. Never been used. Oh shit. I don't want that. I don't want factory lube in the chamber. Oh yeah, look at that. Ugh. Oh, that is fucking nasty. It's basically grease. So this answers a lot of questions. All you assholes are always suggesting grease. Here it is. And uh, all you assholes on the forums, all the noobs who are like, what the hell is that shit in my brand new Glock? Do I remove it or what? I don't know. This will tell you, obviously, because it's scientific. Oh yeah. Okay, so that's sufficiently lubed. Fucking gloves are ruined. <laughs> Grease all over them. I didn't think about that. Okay, so let's factory lube the slide or the frame. Let's make this thing like new. To welcome that new recoil spring in and just make the whole Glock just like new again, you know? Yeah, I can retire this thing. It'll be like brand new again. Retire it back into service instead of being a dedicated YouTube video gun. Look at that. Totally factory lubed. It's pretty good. Beautiful moment. Your fucking rocket biologist down there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's put this thing back together. Um, it's good as new. It's factory lubed. Look at that. That's the factory lube Glock. Okay, let's put our 30 round ghost clip in. Massive, massive capacity assault clip. Yeah. Okay, let's shoot this thing. Wow. So clearly, we restored this Glock back to factory specifications. Good as new. Uh, I suggest that. Uh, Next time you clean your Glock, you lube it like this. Um, yeah, man. That's a factory lube Glock. Okay. Salmon egg juice on me. Glock brand Glock. I'm having I'm trouble sure you closing the, the chamber there. The Glock Surefire proven method too. I need scissors, man. So, oh my